tock, tick, tock. What am I hearing now? The clock. You know, it used to be when you were in your 60s, right? That was difficult to get a job. Now, it's when you're in your 50s, it's more difficult to get a job. Why? Because the focus on technology is normally 20 year olds. They pick it up like that. You teach a 50 year old now, and then a 45 year old, well, who would you rather pay? A 45 year old who demands this kind of a salary, or a 30 year old who's a lot faster, understands all the technology, and is half the price. Hmm, well, I know who I might go for. I might go for the older guy, but most people wouldn't. They wouldn't, they'd go for the younger guy. So yeah, you'd always be employable potentially, but potentially not. And by the way, do you wanna really take that chance? You might, if you're single, do you have a family? Do you have a mortgage? Those things need to be paid off. And um, so I would suggest if you wanna play it like kind of safe, then, then this isn't the place. I mean, this, this is, we want to build big wealth. We want to build, you know. Now, could, could you do it slower if you wanted to? Sure, you could play it even safer. But I mean, what we teach is safe anyway. We only ever risk 1% of somebody's entire portfolio anyway on any one trade, 1%. So if you have 10,000 pounds, that means you're only risking 100 pounds. How, how is that, you know? So for those people who want to play it safe, come here, let's play it safe together so that your life isn't like for me safe is almost is 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 the same so it's the other side of desperate because one little thing the safe now if you're if you don't play it safe and you have a lot of riches right the other side of that coin is safe but the other side of the safe coin is desperate and it could turn just like that i don't want to like fear monger and everything but wh why would you take that chance why i wouldn't take that chance for my children listen in nature and we're part of nature you are either growing or you're dying. There is no moment when a plant suddenly goes, I can't decide, am I growing or not? 50-50. It's either growing or it's dying, okay? So, it's the same in business. If your business isn't growing, it's actually dying. That's why you have to keep pushing, you have to try new things, etc. If you are not progressing in your job, you're not learning stuff, you're not you know, being better every single day, you are actually going backwards because the world is always changing, the world is always getting better, it's always getting faster, it's always like this. There's always more competition. So you've got to keep pushing. It's the same with finance. Don't play it safe. Obviously, do safe strategies, but you should keep looking to expand your wealth all the time because the world is doing that. It's going to catch up and then you're going to be in trouble. So. Well, there's this thing that, that people always say as well, which they teach younger people um, to always save money mm. and you have enough obviously when you're older but what but, but saving is good but if you don't know how to invest the money what's the point of saving where are you going to save it in the bank at one percent so in order because we we are looking to make a living from this right so you're having fifty thousand in the bank a year sorry into your account a year okay at one percent you're going to have to have millions in the bank in order to get fifty thousand you, you, you literally need to have 5 million in the bank at 1% to make 50,000. Have you got 5 million? Most people don't have 5 million, right? So now, if we can teach you how to make 10% a year, well then suddenly, you only need 500,000 in the bank. Ooh, well that's a little bit more achievable than 1%, isn't it? Mm -hmm. hmm. Now, what if, what if we taught you how to make 20%, which by the way, is like a walk in the park for us. It's only for people who don't yet know. That 20% is not a lot. It's not a lot. It's very, very, very achievable. How much do you need? 250,000. So you keep you keep working at that. If you know how to make 100%, which people are gonna say, oh, you can't do that, it's too risky. It's not too risky. It's only cause you don't know what you're doing, right? I'll come back to that. So. If, if you don't have to make 100%, you only need 50,000. So you have 50,000, you can keep making 50,000 every year, but you still have that initial 50,000. You never touch that, and you keep making it. That 50,000 gives you 50,000, you live off that. You make another 50,000, you live off that. You make another 50,000. There is no such thing as risky. There's no such thing as a risky car. There's just a risky driver. Are you a good driver or are you a bad driver? Have you learned how to drive or haven't you? Have you taken advanced tests or haven't you? There's no such thing as a risky stock market. There's only, you don't know what to do, that's all. So risk is so relative. Knowledge overcomes fear. That's what my mentor 
called Tim Norbaker teaches. Knowledge overcomes fear. Most people will say that, oh, the stock market, the stock market. What do you actually know about the stock market? You know what the answer is? Nothing. They don't know anything about the stock market, apart from what they've read from some newspaper written by a journalist. Show me the journalist's bank account. Show me the journalist's stock market account. Zero. It's not written by experts. Learn from people. Don't just learn. Be shown by people who know what they're doing. And then be taught and mentored and coached by those people until you get it. Then you can teach your family. That's why we always have uh, people bringing their, uh, their teenagers. You know, we just did a workshop and had how many teenagers in the room? Six, seven teenagers in the room. Oh, that was fantastic. Can you imagine learning this at 19? I mean, you know, there's people like they're normally like in their 40s and they go, oh, I wish I would have. Well, you can stop wishing. Bring your teenager along. Mm.